have existed since long, long ago. And Ricky has been glued to her friend's side the moment they've collected together and been born as a raindrop. Ricky doesn't care much about her job. She just follows along where her friends go. Ricky and her friends like to stay up in the atmosphere, but one day, her friends wanted to see what it was like when they dropped from the sky to the ground. Why do we even have to go down? It's not like we do anything. At the end of the day, we always end up here on the cloud. Ricky's friend didn't like her attitude. They were annoyed at Ricky. How could she have stuck along with them for so long, but did not even bother to understand what they were made for? And on one unfortunate day, Ricky woke up finding out that her friends already left her alone. I need to find my friends again. I will make it my mission to figure out where they could have possibly gone. Ricky dropped down from the clouds and landed onto a field of grass. Ricky is now in the geosphere where she discovered the solid earth. The rocks look at her with shock as she traveled by herself. Raindrops normally drop by groups, one rock said. She prepared to move on, but the grass didn't want to let her go. They're preventing raindrops from falling onto the soil by their leaves. We need help! It cried out. What's wrong? Oh, you poor thing. You're dehydrated. Ricky decided to stay with the leaves as she felt like it was time to actually do her job as a raindrop. My job here is done. Only one last jump. As she proceeded to remove herself from the leaves and jumped into the soil. Ricky let herself soak through the roots until eventually the blades of grass pat her back out. The blades of grass felt much better after Ricky helped them, which made Ricky feel a little better about her situation. She never realized that she could help so easily by existing. Ricky then decided to proceed to her actual mission, to find her friends. Ricky, like a raindrop, went through many challenges by letting gravity direct her to journey. Along the way, she saw various creatures got trapped in a few puddles. I guess I'm stuck here forever. She saw them struggling, so she assisted a few until she arrived at an attraction that amused her, a water course. As Ricky followed the stream, she is now officially part of the hydrosphere and she was shocked to see that there were solid parts of water in the ocean. She found a few familiar raindrops in the water and they all looked surprised to see Ricky there and so worried that she managed to get all the way there. I followed through the cycle by myself and got to experience so many things. I'm sorry I didn't realize sooner that we were helping tremendously while I was following along with all of you. I was wrong. Throughout all this, Ricky was of course elated to be back with her friends. But mostly, she was relieved to have found the reason why she goes to the same cycle every day. It wasn't something that just happens for no reason. Ricky and the other raindrops exist to help the ecosystem through what they do. And now, Ricky knows this as she evaporates and will eventually find herself back in the cloud.